Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. For this video, I'm going to be reacting to uh, teens respectfully gather rude customer upset over $6. Okay, so um, yeah, I don't understand people like when they get upset about um, like small things. Like um, I've seen videos, people get crazy about uh, restaurants not having a food item that they want. It's like, dang, like, can they just go to another location? Like, it's not that serious. Also, if the store is closed and they're like, I'm hungry, like, just come back another time. Dang, it's not that serious. Eat something else or something. I don't know. It's just weird when um, people want to be rude, but in a dumb way. But, um, yeah, let's see them gather this customer. I don't know what it's about, but, uh, yeah, let's get into the video. And please subscribe. Let me know what else I should react to in the comments below. Also, it's glasses day, so hopefully, um, it doesn't get blurry. Okay. <laughs> Ma'am, please don't act like that. You're a grown woman. You're a grown woman. I'm 17. Get out of here. Don't come back. Don't come back. We don't need your business. Let her know. Let her know. Kaylee and Victoria, <clears throat> employees at Kiki Snowballs in Willis, Texas, showed perfectly how to handle an angry customer at work. Pretty much, I go up to the window and I'm ready to take this woman's order. And I open the window and she already looks upset. Um, so I'm like, hello. Dang, people with stank attitudes just bring in their stankiness around to other places. Like, um, if you have an attitude, just stay home. Like, no one wants to interact with you. So um, you're not that important. Well, what can I do for you? Uh, she tells me that there's been a mishap with her order. The customer says her daughter didn't get an order she paid for. I need my $6 back. Okay, so if they did not get the order after you paid, why not wait and they can make your order? But she's asking for the $6 back, so did they really not get it? And she's trying to steal from them by taking the money back? Because what if she did get the order and then she's just trying to get the money back? Um, does she have a receipt? Like, you can't just walk up to a business or something claiming that you bought something without showing a receipt because what if you're lying? So I feel like she's lying unless she shows a receipt. I'm just listening in the back and eventually like I can hear she's angry the whole time so I was like clearly she just wants to have a problem or, or start something and I'm not about that so I was just like okay let me just go give her six dollars and we can move on move past this <laughs> it was six dollars <laughs> Then the sign fell over, so I opened the window again to pick the sign up. That's when she comes by and slaps the sign out of my hand and calls me a... Uh, Wait, I'm confused. Why she have an attitude? She got her money. So why is she still stanky? Why is she still have a stank attitude after getting her money? I'm confused. Some people are dumb for no reason. I don't understand. <laughs> you can see in the video when she called me. So I just told her, you're a grown woman. There's no reason to be acting like that. Ma'am, please don't act like that. You're a grown woman. You're a grown woman. I'm 17. Get out of here. Don't come back. Don't come back. That, that lady, she business. does not get enough attention at I home or something. Scared and, uh, <laughs> she does not get enough attention in her real life. So she just has to act like this in public to get the any kind of attention that she wants. Uh, very confused. Uh, uh, I wasn't understanding what was going on. And Victoria's so sweet. She just sat there, just kept taking it. I was like, no, you're not going to keep taking that. The owner, Kyle, is proud of how they handled the situation. The lady came up. Oh, I thought that was someone's already dad. Already ready to kind of, I mean, you could just tell immediately she was not looking to. And why are they blowing her face? Blow, blowing her face. Why are they blurring her face? Show the world. Let us know. Handle this in an appropriate way. And then, um, and it was just that the video is so interesting to watch because you know she was standing back there just apparently listening you know acting like she was not but she was listening. and she has an injured foot the sweetest girl ever you know victoria is just 
taking this from this lady and and i was just like this is way too good and she just kept her cool and and um you know did that so no that, i think that was so good for sure the response to the video has been overwhelming people were traveling to come and see us from you know hours away um we had people reaching out to us on TikTok saying hey how can we tip the girls how can we tip the girls and so we we even had people going and leaving google reviews <laughs> that hasn't even been to our shop but they're like we're so proud of those girls and how they handle it kyle hopes the video serves as a reminder to remind us mm -hmm. all really that as a and hopefully this lady sees the video so she know how stank attitude she got um but <laughs> Yeah, like, um, she's lucky they're blurring her face because this video probably has been seen by a lot of people. So, um, if they showed her face, then... Uh, Adults specifically I don't know, people would probably be rude to her in public. Um, you know, so she's lucky. And then through the shift change, we, you know... We well, actually, um, you could probably see her face in the actual video, unless they blurred it themselves. I don't know who blurred the video, but drop the ball. So <laughs> mistakes happen, right? Um, but for you to go up and act like that as an adult, my whole point of you know uploading that video was to and, simply and remind imagine us all being that, that girl's you know, daughter we, and seeing that video. Better, you know, our reputation is. And then her friends are like, "Is this your mom?" And make sure everything's good and embarrassing. And give us that opportunity. I do think that the the idea that you know we we all need to treat people with kindness. If there's a time that we need to make something right, we always go above and beyond. For instance. Okay, so, uh, yeah, the girl's daughter's friends are probably gonna be like, is this your mom in this video? Ew, this is your mom. Um, embarrassing. But anyway, that is the end of this video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Let me know what else I should react to in the comments below. And if you want to see my experiences in Korea, you can check out my Fresh Channel Sexy V. And if you want to see my other socials, it's right here under my face. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.